Hey everyone, Jeremy Blum here. If you're uh, friends with me on Facebook, you might know I've been uh, I've been talking recently about this robotic claw that I've been working on. So I want to share it with everyone. Um, basically, what this is is this is a Edge robotic claw kit. It's from uh, ThinkGeek.com, and it comes with um, you basically put it together from a bunch of parts, and it comes with this controller that gets wired to it normally, and you move these things to move it around. Um, I got bored with that pretty quickly, so this is a project I've been working on like for the last year, on and off. I mean, I haven't spent a whole lot of time on it, but basically what I did here is I took the wire that comes out of the back and normally goes into the controller, and instead I basically cut the controller off and I wired it into a parallax propeller microcontroller. Um, so what I have on this board here is uh, the power circuitry for the microcontroller, uh, the microcontroller itself, which is which is right here and a bunch of relays. So all these relays here and here are in charge of shorting out two of these connections on the wire that comes from the claw and that results in movement in the claw basically. Um, so the reason I wanted to do this was I wanted to make this thing controllable over the internet. So to do that I have this uh, this little mini web server slash ethernet controller here. This communicates via a serial connection right here with the parallax propeller microcontroller and basically what I can do is send this thing commands over the internet through a website I've put together and it'll move this claw around. Um, right now I just have it going through a router on a local connection. Uh, when I go back up to school in a few days I'll set it up there on the internet so I can control it remotely um, but right now I'm just doing it over the local network. It's the same thing. I'll be able to do it over the internet as well from anywhere in the world. Um, but because of that, since I won't always be looking at it, I also got a network webcam. Right now I just have it hanging from um, the blinds in my room. But basically I have it behind the claw, and I can use it to monitor it and move the claw around remotely, which is uh, pretty fun. It's still a work in progress, but I just thought you guys might appreciate checking it out. Alright guys, so sh this is a shot of the web control interface. Basically it's just a pretty simple web page I put together. Um, it'll be accessible remotely once I'm using a router that's actually connected to the internet, but right now I'm just doing this over a local network. Um, so on the left, there's a live stream from the camera. You can see my hand moving around in it. It's, it's, pretty, it's pretty much real time. I'm sure that'll slow down a little bit once it's doing it over the web, but it, it seems pretty, uh, pretty good. And then over here, this is basically just an HTML image map with some links that are executing JavaScript functions to send variables to the little web server I have which then communicates with the microprocessor and tells the claw what to do. So each of these arrows uh, allows me to move the corresponding motor in that direction uh, three magnitudes for each one ex except for the claw open and close so I can move it a little bit, uh, a little bit more and then this is the most. So that's pretty cool, it provides you a pretty good degree of freedom. I'll probably clean this up a little bit in some future revisions. Alright, so what I'll do now, just to give you a quick demo, is I'll, um, I'll pick up this little guy right here. And I'll just look at the image on the computer, so I'm not actually looking at the claw right now, just to show you that I can control it remotely, even though I'm actually more or less right next to it right now. Now I can close the claw to grab it. And I should be able to lift it back up. Alright, and just to give you a little shot of uh, what the movement looks like here. 